My name is Jim Estes, and today I'm going to talk about a drill that I think is extremely important for the swing plane. So what I want you to do is, and this, by the way, is going to give you an instant understanding of exactly the feeling you want to have in the golf swing. Take a club. You can put a rod, alignment rod, in the grip, or I'm sorry, in the butt end of the golf club. Take the golf club, turn it like you're going to hold it, and then what I want you to do is take that club, put it right against your left hip, so you're holding both clubs here. Now you've got an alignment rod on the ground and a golf ball. And what I want you to do, getting into your good posture position, your weight over the arches, getting feel balanced. The insides of the heels are going to be about the width of your hips. Take a swing back, slow motion, and trace with that alignment rod the target line all the way up. The shaft should be parallel to your target line at the top and then slowly coming down, trace the line and do this in slow motion. Right into the impact position. So this is a great feedback tool, visual feedback tool for learning the proper swing plane. Go right to your impact position. I encourage you to do this drill in slow motion. And if you have five minutes a day, if you do this drill every day, I guarantee you're going to improve your golf swing. So again, I think you'll find this to be extremely helpful. JimEstesGolf.com if you have any questions. The reason you hit the ball with your shoulders is because your lower body. Now that one you got some shift, but that's not a normal procedure for you. So I want you to incorporate this drill where you, you get in front of a mirror, put a piece of tape right on the mirror in your bathroom, cross your arms, you're going to have a piece of tape right on that mirror and you're going to turn your left shoulder right under your chin. Your first move is a lateral shift in your hips. There. Your head's not going to go forward, your hips are going to go forward. And then you're going to turn your right shoulder under your chin and toward the target. All right, now you can see here when I swing, I want you to think of moving into the ball with your lower body. And moving forward. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to work on that. That's huge.